Hello. Hello and welcome back to the convenience store. You know, thank you guys for stopping in. Um, as always, you know, feel free to join join the Volchi Mart. Become a member, you know? Like, subscribe, comment, get your get your reviews in, get your requests in. Let me know. But on today's episode, look at all this. Look at all these goodies. All these tasty treats and snacks and fun things. My goodness. Well, we're not going to review any of that. We got a little something special, you know? Something in a box. And here we go, you know? And I'm sure you're wondering, what's in the box? Because who doesn't want to know what's in the box? Well, Brad Pitt doesn't want to know what's in the box. He thinks he wants to know, but he doesn't want to know. So today, we have the... It's like the I-L-Y S-M, um, which I think stands for I love you so much. But they're the I-L-Y S-M shoes. Um, I've been seeing them advertised a lot, and so I wanted to snag a pair and, you know, give them a good, give them a good Volch, give them a good Pia's. See, well, if they're worth the Pia's, we'll find out. So they are the Tabby Savvy, uh, what are they? The Tabby Shadow Stripe Black and Light Gray Stripe. Yeah, let's, oh, let's open the box. Let's just... Sh What's in the box? Whoop. Nice little lid. Who cares about the lid? I know what you guys want to see. You guys want to see these here shoes. So let's bring them out. So I did already wear them in nature. So they do have a bit of a... Nature on them. They're quite interesting. It's kind of like a mix between... It's kind of like a mix between, like, a sock, a sandal, and, like, a slip-on. So, essentially, you can see here, this material is, like, stretchy and very movable. And so, in a way, they're kind of, like, slip-on high tops. Obviously, laceless, no laces. They've got a nice little back strap here. Help you bootstrap them in. And, like... I said they're very light the one also very interesting slash weird thing is they have that like toe spacing and so you can see it on the front see it on the back there's like there's definitely like that toe spacing which is kind of interesting I know like people I don't know you see it in shoes and it's kind of like okay so your big toe has a room of its own what does that do I, I have no clue I mean I think I've seen things that say, like, oh, it's good for balance. It's good for, I don't know, your toes. Got to keep them separated, like like the song that says keep them separated. But I, I really don't know. I don't know what is so special about having the toes separated. But I will say, it's pretty comfy. I uh, took, took, these, took these dogs for a walk yesterday. And, you know, I just kind of went for a little walk around the block. And then I kind of walked around at some garage sales. And honestly, my findings are that these are, they're very light, which is actually great. Just like lifting it and holding it. Um, I, I wear some, some boots sometimes, very heavy. You can like feel the weight of the boot, but these are super light. And so as you're just walking around, you're just kind of like, you feel kind of free, you feel kind of nice just walking around and your little, your little tabby shoes. I will say fashion wise, I, I'm not sure, um, not sure if they go with, with shorts, you know, cause you got the high tops, which kind of look like a little, I don't know, they look a little interesting. And so I think maybe the fashion world, maybe society's not ready for short shorts and high tops of this variety. Um, but that could change. We could change all of that. Because, honestly, like, fashion is, like, what, whatever you want. Make it work. Make it look good. If you can have the confidence to flaunt it, well, people might believe that that's the coolest thing ever. So, wh why not try? Use, you know, you, you slip them on. You're, you're in a rush. You just slip them on. You run out the door. Use your big toe to help you run as you run out the door. And get to where you're going. The back has, like, a nice sold ledge here, too. Not sure if you can see that. But... On the back, um, there's this nice little little ledge, a little extra protection for A, your heel, and B, when you want to take them off, you can kind of just like wedge your other foot on here and just do a little slip slip, and, and it'll slip right off. 
It's pretty nice. Um, the one thing, as I said, I noticed so far um, is with the material. Like I said, it's like this very like kind of clothy, kind of like stretchy material. It unfortunately does seem to catch like a lot of grass and a lot of outdoorsy stuff. So I wouldn't really recommend wearing these hiking because you'll you'll get out of the forest with like some like <laughs> those little spiky balls, those little sticky seeds, everything imaginable with even like the slightest little like hook mechanism to transplant its uh, natural seed. Um, it'll be all over these things. And so you'll be you'll be spreading the forest goodies wherever you go. But then I guess if you wanted to put a bunch of cool seeds in here and just walk around, I wonder if you could like plant gardens where you walk because that'd be kind of cool. So if you want to do that, these might be the shoes for that. But yeah, let, let, let's talk Pia's. What do we got here? We've tried them on, as you can see. You know, they're comfy, they're light. I would wear them around the store, around the house. I wear them. You know, on a boat. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, but I feel like they're they're definitely like multi-purpose shoes. I don't think they do very well with mud or with any sort of water because you get water in there and it's just going right through the sides. There really isn't much room to uh, really step in any puddles. So these are definitely not any puddle shoes or rain shoes. But a nice like sunny day, you just want to go on like a walk around the block. Or if you're in like a big city and you just like want to walk somewhere, these are great. You slip them on um, and you, you tuck your big toe into its little loft and you have yourself a nice little walk, a nice little jog. I wouldn't say they're good for running. They don't really seem to have too much like fluffy support on the bottom, but that's okay. I mean, because when these, unless you're doing like parkour or something, I wouldn't do parkour in these either. Like I feel like the landings would be too rough because it's just a solid piece of rubber. But I also don't do parkour, so I don't know you. I don't really know the requirements of the uh, sport. So all day on Pia's, we're gonna give these tabby shoes by AOISM. Hmm. Yeah, well, we'll give them. We'll give them a three point eight five. You know, I think they're perfect for what I want to do, and I, I want to you know ride bikes. I want to go on walks. I want to walk around places and just like be downtown or just be out in public you know if I want to go on a nature hike well I'll bring my boots if I want to go jump in the puddles I'll bring my boots but these just as some everyday walkers some everyday shoes I think they're pretty good they feel very comfortable very light like I said <laughs> I know the other video was a glove but these actually fit like a glove just on your foot and it just like tucks right up to your ankle. They're easy to get off and on. There's no kind of like friction from the back that I've experienced so far. Cause I know in a lot of like high tops, you get that friction right here, somewhere along your Achilles heel. Um, and it can be very painful, but in these I've not felt that yet. And I've worn them for, I don't know, like three days. Did a lot of walking, got my steps in. This has been the IOY SM the tabby shoes it's the black and gray stripe variety you can get them in all sorts of colors and flavors um, does have the toe wedge thing for the little balance I think um, very comfortable very light and hey get yours today at the Volchi Mart psych you get them online like everything else so yeah folks uh, thank you thank you for stopping in to the old Volchi Mart thanks for coming on down seeing what we got in stock or what cool new things are popping through. Um, as always, you know, have a good day and like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you next week in the Volchi Mart.